Hello Cancer, welcome to your April 2019 reading. Thank you for joining me. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising signs. Cancer, let's take a look at the Shadows and Light Oracle firstly. You've pulled the card of Out Trick or Cheating. Now this is a, a very interesting card because it, it kind of uh, gives you that energy of what shows up at your door and not taking it at face value. Not judging everyone by appearance. Instead, understanding what may lie beneath, discovering what it is that they want, and then feeling out for any strings attached. There may be an energy around this of you needing to, uh, to look beyond what may appear at first glance. To look beneath, to use your, your gut feeling, and not to rely upon appearance for your signals. So it's going to be up to you now to decide whether you're going to take the time to discover what this is really all about or simply judge it based on how it appears to be at first glance. The energy around this card is of, seeing, of helping you see through conditioning, old thought patterns, so that you can see, see beyond what may, what may be just at appearance sake, what's on the surface. Now, around you, the energy of the other person that is around you here is of time. This is from the Goddess Power Oracle, and it's the, uh, the Celtic Goddess of time. You may be worried that you're running out of time, or there's not enough time. Do you feel that you're too late, too stressed, too overwhelmed? There is an attitude around this of, of having that energy be fueled by fear. The goddess of time has an alignment task for you. Know that even if you're temporarily struggling, you'll always have enough time to choose how you experience your reality. You could always course correct. So consider this, struggles, disappointments, delays are all part of the experience of life on life's terms. And this too shall pass. So when cooler heads prevail and faith steers your course, Treasure is never far away, so if, you f if there's a feeling of being overwhelmed here, it may be because this, this, of this delay, but I feel like this delay is needed, this time is needed in order to find out the truth behind something. So let's, let's have a look. We'll see where this goes here for you, Cancer. I'm going to use the crystal visions for you, so let's get started. First thing I want to see what you've brought to this situation in the past, Cancer. What have you brought to this? Whoa, okay, that one's fallen. Just one moment. Okay, the King of Swords in reverse. So I do feel that someone's been less than truthful. I have it as you, but of course it can read vice versa, the opposite way around. But someone's been untruthful, someone has been not acting with uh, integrity, uh, lying, uh, reckless energy around this, this individual. Let's see what the other person has brought to this in the past. What has the other person brought to this situation in the past? For cancer. Oh, I've got two here. All right, yes, okay. Six of Swords in Reverse and the Seven of Swords in Reverse. Hmm. So there's been a, uh, an energy of this not moving. Uh, I feel a stagnant energy around this because somebody, I feel it's this other person here, has been less than truthful about their their situation or their circumstances so things just haven't moved i feel that there's been lies here someone has not told the truth mm. now you've wanted to find out why this is you've wanted to find out the answers You've, you've asked, or you, at least you've, you've thought about asking, why this isn't moving? Why is this not, doesn't seem to be progressing? Let's see where you currently stand with this. The Ace of Cups, okay, so an opportunity for, for love, for 
have a romantic romantic feelings, the exchange of, uh, of true and honest feelings. So the opportunity is there, but let's see. Where does this other person currently stand? The hangman in reverse and, okay, temperance in reverse. Ooh. Wow, okay. Mm. All right, well, immediately I feel like this person I have it as you, Cancer, but it could be the opposite way around. It's somebody, it could be somebody doing this to you, actually. Around this person who hasn't been telling the truth, they now they now have love around them, but I don't feel it's with you. I feel that this is some other opportunity that they have around them for renewal. It could be a past love. And where you currently stand, if this is you, Cancer, and I feel it might be this energy down here is that you're feeling like you've been left out to dry here and now you you've developed feelings for someone and they've just kind of left you hanging and you're feeling that a lack of balance in your life there's a sense of confusion you're not sure why you've been left like this uh, this person just seems to have just gone off towards this other opportunity and just kind of left you there and, and now there's this feeling around you of of anger i get anger yes conflict you want to know why you want to know why cancer mm, okay let's take a look where do you see, where does this person hope to be in the future with this where does this person hope to be? Seven of Swords in reverse. Okay. So they're wanting to, to change their ways, to turn over a new leaf. So where they've been sneaky in the past, where they've been doing dirty tricks, uh, lying, uh, being ruthless, not acting with honesty and integrity, now they're wanting to turn that around. They're wanting someone to forgive them, Let's see where you hope to be in the future with this cancer. I feel the energy is more you down here. I do. I feel like you're dealing with someone though that has kind of left you hanging. They've been, you've been wondering why it's taking so long for this to get going. And rather than take it at face value, I, I get that you're needing to, you've needed time here to see, to see what's beyond appearances. What, where do you hope to stand with this in the future? Okay, the devil and the tower in reverse. Mm, okay, wow. Oh, well, you're definitely, you're definitely hurting from this. You're definitely feeling the... Uh, Feeling that this person has, mm, mm. I just pick it up as as a lot of conflict. You feel like this. Now you 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 tied to this. You you want you actually still want some kind of connection with this person, but it's based out of. I was getting like an obsessional energy, I have to say. Mm, yeah. They are sorry. They're sorry for what they've done, but you're not having it, Cancer. You're not having it. Okay, let's take a look. How is this person viewing this Cancer? The star in reverse, yeah. So they don't see a future, uh, they don't see a, a healing, they don't see that this is going to get better. Let's take a look and see how you're viewing them, Cancer. How is Cancer viewing this other person? 
ten of swords in reverse so you feel betrayed you feel hurt you feel that this person has just ended this left you hanging and you want answers you want answers and I also feel an energy around this uh, you, you want to, to heal from this you want to heal from the pain that this person has inflicted because now I get the sense that you're stuck you're stuck in this energy of uh, having a gain some kind of I, I get it as an attachment an unhealthy attachment to to this individual who's been lying to you you've been wondering why things haven't been progressing they haven't been moving why they've been stagnant you've been wanting to find out the answers Mm, let's take a look and see what the challenge is. Well, actually, rather, let's have a look first at the hopes and fears. What are the fears for this person? What are the fears? Strength in reverse. Okay, so there, there's a weakness around this individual. They have a weakness, especially as it relates to temptation, being tempted by people. There may be even addicti an addictive nature to this relationship now is what I'm picking up. Let's have a look and see the uh, fears for, the, for you, I feel, Cancer. Of course, it can resonate the opposite way, but I feel that this is more your energy here. Cancer. What are the fears for Cancer? With this person, fears for Cancer. What are the fears for Cancer? The Six of Pentacles in reverse, yeah. For you, you feel uh, like this is an unequal situation. You feel like this person, you've been giving to this person, but they have, uh, they've just taken from you. They haven't given you back equally. There's a sense here of them having, having given to you something, but it, it's it's because they wanted something from you. It was not an equal kind of give and take here. They, they may have been giving to you because they wanted something. I feel it's more like a, a sexual thing, a temptation. They may have wanted to get you into bed here, Cancer. But they didn't see a future. There's actually something around them, a renewal. And you were not aware of this. Let's take a look. What is the challenge for this person? What is the challenge for this person? The Four of Cups. Well, the challenge is they, they get bored easily. They, they get very bored, bored with life. They may be going through some kind of midlife crisis here or some mild depression. They're not happy with what they have. So they've been looking... They've been looking to spice up their life liven up their life and i feel like they've gotten involved with you cancer because of that but for them they they need to find other avenues other ways to to alleviate boredom rather than mess up other people's lives i feel Let, let's take a look and see what the challenge is for you here cancer what is the challenge for cancer Challenge for Cancer. The lovers, yeah. You've been lovers with this person. Or you want to be lovers with this person. I have you as lovers. I feel like you've been lovers with this person. But they've ended it. And they've. you feel betrayed. You feel like you're stuck now. Like you. you this is a one-sided thing. Uh, unrequited love it, it's left you feeling very uh, very much unbalanced you, you'd like to heal from this what this person has caused this damage that this person has caused but now there's like an obsessional energy here I get uh, quite an this was quite an addictive thing this addictive love affair it was moving slowly though with this time energy I feel like it was moving really slowly but there was a reason why it was moving slowly so that something could be revealed to you 
and it has to do with looking beneath the surface, looking beyond what had appeared because I get that this person was lying. Whatever that they were saying to you was lies. Just so they, they could get you into to bed. Uh, lovers I have this as. Mm. Mm. So let's take a look at the outcome here for this other person before we go to part two. If this is resonating, I hope that you join me in the extended version here, Cancer. The link will be below in the descriptions box and that will be on the Vimeo channel. So please join me for part two. Let's take a look and see firstly, that we'll take a sneak peek at the outcome for this other person. The magician, yeah. And we also have the Hierophant and the Knight of Wands in reverse. Okay. So this person that they seem to be quite in and out. They were here one one minute and gone the next. There was a reason for that, I feel. Something that you didn't know about. This person may be someone who has a position of authority possibly in uh, around you in your workplace or something like that i have them as possibly a teacher uh, or an advisor of some kind the magician here tells me that this person feels like they they can do this that they can they can come in and out like this mm. let's take a look and see what the outcome is for you here cancer what is the outcome here for Cancer? Okay, we've got the Ace of Wands. We've got the Eight of Cups. What is the outcome here for Cancer? Okay. And the Page of Cups in reverse. All right. So this was a very sexual relationship. I do feel like someone around you uh, was doing this for validation there was a lot of seduction flattery uh, very much a, an immature kind of energy around this other individual and there's a someone's walking away so we'll see what happens in part two I hope that you join me there the link will be below in the descriptions box and that will be on my Vimeo channel if I don't see you there cancer then I wish you all the best with this if you would like a personal reading, you can email me, gypsyinsights at gmail.com. And I will speak to you again very soon. Bye for now, Cancer.